Hey everyone, it's Mindy from the OG Sports Network. Excited to bring you some plays here today in the Major League Baseball League. <laughs> uh, but good morning and happy uh, Cinco de Mayo. Hopefully you had a, a great night. Uh, hopefully you had a winning horse, number three. I had two, so did not quite have it come in, darn it. Uh, but that's the way that it works sometimes. Uh, but enjoyed my little, uh, you know, party and everything else. So it was, it was good. That's for sure. So hopefully, uh, you get some more relaxation here today. All right. Before we get started here with Major League Baseball, make sure you go ahead and like, subscribe, click on the bell to get the latest notifications because you don't want to miss out on any of this excellent sports information. Um, also, go ahead and check out our multi capper site. It is called ogcappers.com where you can find the best of the best picks around, you guys. That's right. You can find the best of the best picks. So make sure you get there and you can go ahead and sort by hot capper, right? All you need to do is click on Major League Baseball and you can say, hey, who are the hot cappers in Major League Baseball? You can see it's folks like Nick and Ruben and Pravi, Mindy Tiffany, and of course, Ron Hahn, totally getting it done in Major League Baseball. Uh, so then you just click on your favorite capper, purchase one of their pick packages. Make sure you always use that promo code. There it is, OG20 to save you 20% at checkout. So make sure you get that done as well. Just remember all of our pick packages are profit guaranteed, meaning that if our cappers don't turn a profit, you get credits back to your account. So it's basically a win-win situation all around. All right. Are you ready for some Major League Baseball action? Here they are, 15 picks again. You can uh, eat your tacos and chips and salsa. Where are you watching games here today? I think we uh, we had that last night, so I think we're going to go with the brats, uh, brats and chips and beans here today. That's what's on our menu. Uh, but if you're not familiar with how this works, I have a Major League Baseball model. I come up with variances on how to select those. And then, of course, I compare those to Vegas and their opening odds. So I know about how often my pick will win or lose versus Vegas. So I will go ahead and give you that confidence factor there. And uh, you will notice early on here, we'll be on a lot of totals. Uh, we usually have the advantage for about mm, the first two, three months. And then after that, Vegas starts catching up with us here a little bit. So if you uh, are not for, you know, don't like the totals, it will also see there is going to be a final score prediction there too. So you can take a look to see what side I'm actually on. All right. Ready? Should we get started? Maybe. All right, here we go. So we're going to start with, of course, an under. <laughs> right? We're rooting for lots of no scoring here again today. Uh, there were some teams that busted it out yesterday, right? The A's got 20. Uh, who else? It was like the Rangers got a big number. I don't know. I can't remember all of them right now. But uh, the Padres, they had a big number. But anyway, there was only about four or five that had a big number. Everyone else was uh, little. And those were the ones that were kind of as expected. All right. But each of the last seven games here between these two teams have gone under the total. So they're getting it done again today. I have it coming in around six and the total sitting at eight. 58.2% of the time, this play will be on the under, 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 under. So this one, I don't really have a pick for you. Look at that. That's high. All right, next up is going to be between Detroit and the Yankees. They've had a pretty decent series, I think, so far. But seven of the Tigers' last eight games have gone under the total. And I guess, you know, Judge got his first ejection. Uh -huh. Probably many more to come. But look, I have this one, another two-to-two -two tie ball game. 52.8% of the time, this will be the play. Let's take the under. Ah, our first, our first question mark of the day. So we're going to go ahead and give you this play via text message. All you got to do is text the word WIN, W-I-N, to 223-203-1821. And from there, you will go ahead and receive text messages. It will have this play as well as a play in the NBA and NHL. And it's our second highest rated game on the board. 
Excuse me. Uh, I know I should not be yawning, but man, <laughs> it just happens sometimes. That's the bad part about recording live. All right. But yeah, so just go ahead and give us a text and then we will give you the 65.9 percenter. All right. Next up. All right, there it is, the VIP play of the day. If you want this play, you need to go ahead and go to ogcappers.com. You need to go to the OG's VIP section. Uh, from there, you can either purchase the three pack of plays, which will have the NBA, NHL, and Major League Baseball, or you can purchase this play individually, 67.5% of the time. This will be the play. So if you want this one, just go ahead and go there. Make sure you use that promo code OG20 at checkout. Next up is going to be between the Mets and the Rays. Uh, Rays have gotten it done the last couple days here. We're going to go ahead and go under the total. Another tie, three to three. There it is. Both of these teams are six and four to the under in this season. So let's go under the total. Tie ball game. This is not soccer. All right. Next up is going to be between. The Texas Rangers versus your Kansas City Royals. We're going to go over the total. Both of these teams are six and four to the over. I mean, they're putting up big numbers. Here it is. I got Texas here winning seven to two. So it looks like it will be the over in this play. All right. Let's go ahead and go next. Each of the Mariners' last eight games have gone under the total. This has been an under series. Uh, that's for sure. Have this one coming in at eight. Have the Mariners plus money here, winning this one six to two. Going to take the under 61.8% of the time. This will be the play. All right. Red Sox. Twins. Twins keep getting it done on a huge winning streak. Are they going to do it here today? Well. I'm pretty sure they're going to go under the total. I have this one sitting at two to two. It's going to be interesting. Who gets the last one here? 58.7% of the time. This will be the play. Each of the Red Sox last five games now have gone under the total as well. Can't wait for this one. Should be good. All right. The White Sox keep, uh, you know, uh, hanging in there with teams. I feel like they are really at least producing runs, right? Like that's kind of, you know, the name of the game here. Uh, but this one here, we're going to go ahead and be on the Cardinals 60.6% .6 of the time. This will be the play. It's our highest rated one. No total in this one. Uh, but we have this one going over six to two, but the White Sox have lost 16 of their last 17 games versus these national leaguers. Uh, all righty. Let's go ahead and take the Cardinals. Another good series, as usual. Hasn't been disappointing at all. Uh, they scored lots of runs yesterday. A little surprising, but not today. Going under this total 63.9% of the time. This will be the play. Have this one. The Cubs winning 3-2. to two. Four of the Cubs' last five games have gone under the total, you guys. So let's go under. All right. The Marlins got smoked again by the A's. What was it, like 20 to 5 or something? It's crazy. But Oakland has covered the run line, right? And it's last seven versus the Marlins now. Man, that's crazy. That's putting up a huge number. Oh, and look at this one. It's only predicted to be, I don't know, 12 to 4. <laughs> so it looks like another big total game here based off of, uh, you know, pitching and uh, batting factor, park factor. Should be a big one. 62.5% of the time, the A's will be victorious. Let's do it. All right. And next up is going to be the Braves versus the Dodgers. Uh, looking for another under total. 58.1% of the time. Have this one a virtual tie. <coughs> three to three score. Nine of the Braves' last 11 games have gone under the total now. Also. All right. Padres said they were ones that put up one of those big scores versus the Diamondbacks. The Diamondbacks have now lost their last four as favorites. Now they're short favorites at minus 120. I'm looking for Padres here, 
plus 155.5% of the time. Looks like a play. I'm going to take it. I have them winning nine to three. So also looks like a little over the total, kind of like how it did yesterday. Um, it was where it was one-sided. Padres got all the runs. All right. Uh, the Orioles versus the Reds. I think the Red City Connects hats are a little bit weird, like how they cut off the C. I don't know. Uh, I prefer to have the full C there. Other than that, I would think it's pretty cool the way that it kind of looks like some old 70s style um, art. You know, that's kind of how I see it. Uh, but going under the total, three to one is going to be the score. Orioles being victorious. Six of the last seven between the Orioles and the Reds have gone under this total now. <laughs> I had to cough. Goodness. Uh, but yeah, I like the Orioles and the under here in this one today. Giants and Phillies. Is this right? We already made it to the last game, Sunday night baseball. Let's go under this total, have it four to three. Uh, Phillies being the victor, six of the Giants' last eight games have gone under the total now. And this one's coming in pretty high, 63.7% is the variance. I will take it, that's for sure. All right, you guys, hey, that is all I have for you today. Again, I appreciate everyone's support. Make sure you go ahead and check out all of Bo's videos. He may not have as many totals as me. <laughs> he may give you more game versus game action. Uh, or team versus team is what I'm saying. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and uh, make sure you get to see Bo's video series. Also have plays out in the NHL and NBA. Swept the cards there yesterday. All right, you guys. Hey, good luck. Enjoy your weekend. Bye-bye.